The classical mechanical engineer may only affect air conditioning and boilers. A civil engineer should focus just on the windows and the building fabrics, and the architect just worry about how the building is designed. In reality, all of these questions have to work in integration with each other. Teams are becoming far more integrated, working closer together, trades are overlapping with each other, and we're looking for a new generation of engineers. One of the good things about this program is you actually have to have work experience behind it. So I'm learning a lot from my classmates. They're actually teaching me a lot from their industries, their countries, their backgrounds. And not only for the high performance building, I'm learning a lot from the other MEL students. It's making me a globalized professional. Making green buildings which uh, can perform well is one of my interests. As I was working, I realized that uh, I really want to enhance my knowledge. We're now looking at trying to reduce the emissions and the environmental impact of buildings by 80 and 90 percent whilst improving the indoor environmental quality. That's not easy. You will learn so many things at the same time, so you will be equipped in your future. And the best part is that you will learn a lot about being a good leader. What's really interesting about the business classes is that there's a, a whole suite of themes that run throughout every class. The themes are communication skills where they're expected to be able to practice presentations, uh, speaking publicly, written reports, so all different modes of communication, as well as being able to practice the, the different leadership styles. I have worked six years before this program. I have seen design problems, management problems before and now I know how to solve them and not to make those same mistakes. So this year is actually changing everything for me.